What's up, Rich? Still in Nations in the house. Heinz Ward here on the red carpet on the biggest night in Hollywood, the Academy Awards. And I'm excited to be out here and looking forward to picking these actors and actresses' brains. Let's go have some fun. What's going to happen is, and it's going to get crazy in a few yeah. minutes, when all these people start coming down the red carpet, and it's all these different stars, and you're like, who's that person? Where's that person? And what movie are they in? So are you ready? I, I don't know. I'm a little nervous. But I'm going to watch you from over there. You handle this, Heinz, okay? How are you, you doing, doing man? man? Good. Heinz Ward filling in. How are you doing? Look at nice to meet you. Oh, oh, we right just here. saw Pittsburgh and Baltimore hugging. Oh, you're a Baltimore oh, man. Oh, she was a we cheerleader. I wasn't even going to bring that up. Oh, we had our rivalry. Oh, okay. oh. So do you root for Baltimore when they're playing against us? Oh, oh yeah. Yes. And I'm, I'm Cincinnati. I'm from yeah. You're and Cincinnati? I'm so I don't got a chance. We're not even going to talk to you. Is that Rich Eisen? See, Robin say, what's up to you? This is the Super Bowl, I guess, uh, for all the entertainers. You know what it feels like. Yeah. You work for this one moment. And yeah, it's an honor to be nominated. Like, it's an, o an honor to play in the Super Bowl and get in the, in the playoffs. But you know the sweet taste of victory. So they want to hear their names. They're no different. Are those the envelopes of the winners uh, for tonight for the Oscar award? They are. Uh, they're actually in there? They're in there. All 24. All 24. Now, I know you're a Cowboys fan. You know, I'm a Cowboys fan, I must say, because we have a restaurant in Dallas and Jerry Jones comes to our restaurant all the time. Oh, I'm with Ali. Jerry so Jones if you invite man. me to Pittsburgh, I might change colors. Well, I, uh, we got to do that. black and gold. Nick Nolte, Heinz Ward hey, here. Man, how are you, how doing? Are you doing? I'm sorry, I had to come over here. I know this is not your first rodeo. It's my first rodeo. Yeah, yeah. So what's the best part about the Academy Awards here? Well, you know, getting to see the other other players, you know, that's what it is. Well, I had to put some eye candy for all the guys out well, there. Well, thank you for picking me. No, is there a favorite team that you like? I'm a kind of a boxing girl myself. You're boxing? Who's yeah. your favorite boxer? I love ultimate fighting. You know, I'm a martial artist. Can I stand beside you? Nice to see you. <laughs> you know, it's always a pleasure to watch you. Why is that? You enjoy it. I do. You enjoy have it. the best smile on your face all the time. I'm always and, happy. I'm always happy because you're doing the thing that you love to do. So what do you guys look for when you come to the the Oscars? Because I don't know what the cleavage, is. babe. Cleavage? <laughs> it's all about the cleavage. That's right. That's for the NFL boys. <laughs> as long as you're looking at my cleavage. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's would be a nice touchdown dance for me oh. if I score a touchdown. Can you just give me a sample of that? Grit. <laughs> 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 I can take him to the club with me any night. When I score a touchdown, you got it right here, Rich. I don't speak English good, but communication is my favorite. But you're having a great time. Right. Harvey, how you doing? What network I agreed to do. Ah, how you doing? Ask me who designed my, my suit. Who designed your suit? George Clooney. George Clooney? He told me that if I wore this, I'd be as cool as him. <laughs> Turns out he's a much, much better actor than he is a designer. I'm not that cool. <laughs> <laughs> I was at the Super Bowl in Indianapolis, yeah. the New York Giants, which is where I live, kick Tom Brady's butt. <laughs> now Tom Brady comes to my town and he trash talks in front of me all the time. Oh, so whatever. Let's get back. So this is a payback. Hi Mr. Brady, if yeah. you're sitting at home watching, wondering how Super Bowls are won, come over to New York City. Wow. <laughs> you heard it first. Isn't it fun? Oh, it's awesome. This it's is the Super my Bowl. first time here. How about you? It's my first time. I wanted right. you since okay. you're nominated. Oh, look at it. Single breasted peak of hell. That's what we did. Uh -huh. It's good. So I look sharp? Yeah, I'm absolutely. Just what is your favorite team in the NFL? Do you have uh, one? Yes, the 49ers. The 49ers. Yeah, since Joe Montana days. A Joe Montana days? Yeah. Do you find yourself going back to, to Candlestick Park and rooting? Because they beat our tails. This I do. I do it every once in a while. Last time I went there, the Oakland Raiders, somebody, a fan threw a liter bottle of soda. I mean, hit me on the shoulder. Uh oh. So, yeah. How you doing, Jay? Hey, man. It's good uh, to see you. Big, big fan, fan. Big fan. How you oh, doing? Likewise. Man? You're uh, kidding me. Come on. Now, it's I'll, an honor. I got to see you in a football movie. Let's be honest. Uh, I have the body of an athlete. Yeah. You can't tell under this tuxedo, but it's like, uh, it's ridiculous. Yeah. So does Nick. Yeah, you know, honestly, if you lift your arm too quickly, his muscles will make the jacket break. Well, if, yeah. you, play, if you did play football, what position would you be? Tight end. <laughs> <laughs> How you doing there? Heinz well, Ward, filling in for Rich Eisen oh, podcast. Great, great. Don't catch. <laughs> <laughs> I've done this for 30 years now, so I know a lot of people. And it is a, an amazing time to, to see people that you've known over the years. And Does it get old? No. 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 no if it gets old, you should do something else. Exactly. <laughs> mm -hmm.
So what is the main specialty dish that you're serving tonight? Well, What's your... This year we're going to have a grazing menu and we're going to have favorite dishes from all of our restaurants. But what I about, just... could I find the soul food, the collard greens? Oh, the you would love the chicken pot pie. Oh, yeah? And the macaroni and cheese. That's you would I'm love that. That sounds like home. Tell me this. Do they give out, everybody get an Oscar, or is this one Oscar? Do y'all share it from one day to another? No, you get to touch it. You get to touch you it, maybe, it's like a hold... party. Yeah, that's right, you get that's right. Day. You hold up, you kiss it, exactly. you hold up, you scream, yeah. and then you, and you hand, hand it, it, it off to, to your teammates. Person. Yeah, we call it the sticky Lombardi, because yes. everybody touches it. Absolutely, it's nice. Yeah. See, we're yes. in the same environment. We are, it's the same. That's one man can't win the Oscar no, That's right, himself. exactly. It's a, group it's, a team, it's a teamwork. Will tonight be your first Oscar if you win? Do you have a special? It's my first time that I'm nominated for an Oscar, yeah. yeah. Do you have a special place for it if you win? I'm not talking about that because I don't know. We'll you see. Oh, you don't want to Right now, it. I'm just nominated. When guys are disappointed that they didn't win, any animosity towards somebody who didn't win? Especially if you felt like you yeah. deserved to win. Yeah. No, no, you got to get used to losing. I mean, you got to learn how to lose because yeah. that's primarily what's going to happen to you in your life. Correct. And if you learn how to lose good, then you got a chance to win yeah. because you learn how to deal with it, you know. Oh, we lost to the Packers. I, I know. It's <laughs> not a great feeling, but know. what is that you're wearing right there? Oh, that my friend. just a little summertime dress. No, I'm wearing Diane von Furstenberg. Oh, very nice. Expensive earrings that are mine. I'm are sure all your viewers are going to be totally interested in my earrings. No, yeah, yeah. Oh, <laughs> well, so what is your routine ritual before coming to the awards? Do you lay out your whole outfit? You got no. like four or five different outfits? The most important thing thing is to have at least two beers. Two beers. <laughs> <laughs> I have a documentary called Undefeated. It's nominated for an Academy Award tonight. Wow. This is a great, great movie good. against gigantic competition tonight. Well, good luck. We win luck. that one. It could be as exciting as winning the big one. Uh, now, do you still have the terrible towel? I, I do. I yeah. have the terrible towel. Now, you, you ain't jumping off the bandwagon because we lost to the Broncos, right? <laughs> You're still waving the terrible towel, right? I was down there waving the terrible towel, and these really huge guys were running by me. Did you have a there blast in Hinesville? Was I awesome? did. I had the best time. What is the best thing about the Academy Awards and being here and trying to get an Oscar. Well, you know, the whole world loves the winners and a guy like George Clooney, I'm just rooting for him. He's doing the right thing because he does things that are not going to be forgotten. Everybody's going to remember it. I love him. Do you have a spot for your other Oscar? <laughs> you know, somewhere in the house. Do you, I, know, do you? I do think it's going to, unless I speak French, I don't think I have much to worry about tonight. <laughs> do you get uh, the NFL Network in Italy? Yeah, I do. Do you? Sure. You yeah, you know, I watch Rich Eisen all the time. Yeah, that's my guy. <laughs> How pumped are you to see some Steelers fans in the house? Man, Steelers Nation's everywhere. <laughs> you know, that's what I love about our fans. We got the best fans in all of football. That's going to do it for this week's show. We'd like to thank John Harbaugh and Mike Tannenbaum for joining Rich at the Combine in Indianapolis. Hines, I think we had the better gig this week. Oh, there's no question. Uh, to be here in the biggest night in Hollywood, uh, the Academy Awards, you know, all the actors and actresses trying to get that one prestigious Oscar award. Uh, that's what it's all about. This is the Super Bowl of all Super Bowls. You've played in two Super Bowls. How did this atmosphere compare to the ones that you participated in? You know, just the, the screaming, uh, the photo ops, uh, the interviews, uh, that's what comes along with it. You know, only difference is uh, the winners are already predetermined. You don't yeah. have to go out there and determine right. on the field. Right. How pumped are you to see some Steelers fans in the house? Man, Steelers Nation's everywhere. <laughs> you know, that's what I love about our fans. We got the best fans in all of football, and today they're here in Hollywood supporting the Oscars night. I'd be remiss if I didn't ask who you were wearing right now. Who am I? Nah, you know what? It, it looked like a uh, George Clooney outfit, so I'm going to say the. He's the Forrest Clooney uh, suit that I got, <laughs> the fake one. I'm wearing some Calvin Klein. You mentioned George Clooney. How great of an interview was that? Man, it was awesome. He's just a great sports fanatic. Overall, I'm just excited to be here. I was more like a, a fanatic more than anything, yeah. so I'm honored to have the opportunity to do this. Big stars out here on the red carpet. We did get snubbed. I'd have to mention that. James, NFL Network. NFL James. Network. Come on, side. Come on, side. Rooney, NFL, NFL Network. Jonah, NFL. NFL, Jonah. She looked at NFL like... Brad and Angelina were out here making the rounds. They're like rock stars. They truly are, and this is the biggest night in Hollywood. Rich, I appreciate the opportunity. Hopefully we can do this next year. For Chris Law, Rich Eisen, Mike Del Tufo, Heinz Ward, I'm Chris Brockman. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next week.